Good afternoon. My name is Tess Jones, and I am the manager for the IU Summer Music Clinic. For those in the audience, it is my pleasure to welcome you to the Musical Arts Center for the 2024 IU Summer Music Clinic Cream Band performance. Before we start the concert, I ask that you please turn off or silence all cell phones. We ask that you make you take no flash photography within the performance hall as it might adversely affect the performance. Now, without further delay, it is my pleasure to introduce the Cream Band and their conductor, Dr. Jason Nam.
Thank you so very much. That first piece was by also by Nicole Puno. If you're here for the last part of the program with Dr. Richardson and the Crimson Band, uh, we also played a piece by Nicole. Uh, her very exciting Bright Shadow Fanfare, which has received a, a lot of play, a lot of ensembles across the, the country playing this that particular piece. The next few pieces we'll play for you. Um, the, well, the next piece is called 12 Gallon Hat by the composer Julie Giroux. Uh, if, again, if you were here for the earlier part of this afternoon, you heard the Cowboys Overture by John Williams. So we also have our sort of offering for uh, uh, old Western type of theme. Uh, very exciting piece, lots of little vignettes and you can really see the, the, the pictures and, and scenic views of the Old West. And indeed, Julie Drew has had a career in, in film music, and, and you can hear a lot of the cinematic nature uh, through this piece. Uh, the next piece we'll play after that will be uh, On Parade by Amanda Aldridge, uh, and then O Manu Mysterium by Morton Lordson, a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful setting, originally written for choir and translated to band, and we'll finish things off uh, with Urban Light by James David. Uh, so this next piece, again, is 12 Gallon Hat. Uh, we hope you enjoy, and uh, I, I've been told I have a, a costume change, so uh, a promise is a promise, so I've got to change costume real quick.
since we'll be handing out awards after the next piece, I want to just express my gratitude right now for this outstanding ensemble that you've heard on stage. Uh, this, this has been a really special group. Um, just the amount of growth and, and musicianship that has occurred throughout the week um, from start to now at the finale concert, that growth and progress has just been incredible. And it's a testament to these students' hard work and their, their just passion and enthusiasm for music, music making. So I can't thank the Cream Band enough. Can we give the Cream Band another big round of applause? And I would also be remiss not to mention my thanks for all of our staff and faculty, our administrative staff, um, our, uh, certainly our manager, Tess Jones. Tess is actually leaving us, unfortunately, uh, but Tess is leaving to, uh, to uh, bigger and better things. Uh, she is employed. She's going to finish her doctorate soon, and, and uh, the sky's the limit for Tess. So we're so thankful for Tess, who really uh, pulls a lot of this together, and we couldn't do this without her, but we're going to try our very best. <laughs> uh, I almost, I almost uh, tried to... I joked that I tried to sabotage her degree program so she could stay a little longer, but uh, sadly, that's, that's, uh, that didn't happen. So, uh, but we're so thankful for Tess and, um, and for all of our staff here at the IUSMC. The next piece we're going to play, it, again, is O Manu Mysterium. Um, this has been certainly a piece that has been a lot of focus this week. Um, just a beautiful setting of the kind of classically used um, O Manu Mysterium uh, Latin text. Uh, we talked a lot about this week, uh, just how we adapt our sounds to try to emulate the kind of smoothness and richness of the choral uh, medium. And these, these students have done such a wonderful job. So, Oma New Mysterium, we hope you enjoy it.
Thank you so much. Really lovely, wasn't it? Let's give them another hand. That's not, that's not easy to do. So I was continually impressed by this group throughout the week and all of our students. We've reached the portion of uh, this, this part of the program where I'd like to uh, call some names and recognize some students that were nominated by the IU SMC faculty, ensemble directors, as just uh, really having the qualities throughout the week, uh, kind of setting themselves apart in various ways, whether it be through their musicianship, through their attitude, uh, just their receptiveness to information, uh, just the way they, they carried themselves through the clinic. So we do this from time to time, and this year, wanted to uh, have this uh, show of, of support and, and appreciation for um, all of our students, but these students really seem to set themselves apart. So if I could have some counselors uh, help. And as I call names on, for students on stage, if you would stand, you'll receive a certificate from one of our counselors. And if, then if you could please be seated after that. That'll help us find all of you quickly. And for you audience members, if you would please hold your applause till the end. And that way we can kind of get through all these names rather quickly. And then we can applaud all of them. Uh, so with in no certain order, let's start with Dakota Trittinger. Abby Thomas. Ethan Shade, Diego Rowley, Kayla Pleasant, Nash Wheatley, Akio Weiss, Abram Yi. Edward Zhao, Madison Zimmerer, Charlie Nethery, Alex Copeland, Jonathan Ditch, Sal Von Lazuski. Josh Gilbert, Cy Hogan, Thomas James, Penelope Bobo, Faith Murphy, we're almost there. Jack Mary, Angelina Orahood, okay. let's give these students a big round of applause. <laughs> Thank you. We are just so proud of all these students, every student that has uh, graced the stage this afternoon, uh, and we're certainly appreciative to all of our, of our repeat campers. Uh, we hope that, that your students and, and, and all of you on stage choose to come back if, if you can. Uh, we really have uh, really enjoyed our time with you this week. Uh, we've also come to the portion where I'd like to uh, call uh, about four names. We, every year we're given uh, a number of $400 scholarships to Indiana University awarded through the auspices of the Office of the Vice Provost for Undergraduate Education at IU. It's based on, again, remarkable work this week and intended for students that may have uh, IU uh, as a possibility in their future. Maybe you're a graduating senior, maybe you're a junior and rising to a senior and looking at institutions. So if, you are, uh, if that becomes your reality, you're here at IU, you have a little bit of extra money, a scholarship money to help with books and some expenses. So uh, the four students that were awarded the $400 scholarships this year from the university were Theo Bednar, <laughs> Dominic Travis, and I believe two students from the orchestra, Macy Heimberger, 
and Riley Allison. So those four students, if you would please come up to me after the concert and I will hand you your, your letter and with more instructions on um, what to do next for uh, the scholarship. Thank you all so much. Uh, we're going to now move on to our final piece of the afternoon and our final piece of the concert. This piece is called Urban Light by the composer, the award-winning composer James David. The piece is named after the art installation uh, and uh, landmark in Los Angeles of the same name. And if you've ever been uh, and seen this landmark, it's a collection of, of uh, light lanterns and street lights uh, all kind of collected together from areas of California and Portland, Oregon. Uh, it's quite a sight and this piece kind of uh, reflects the composer's feelings about the kind of angularity, the kind of, uh, kind of hard edge to the, the art installation and also kind of uh, inspired him to write kind of sounds of, of rock and metal uh, at the same time. Um, these kind of Morse code gestures you'll hear that actually spell out the word California. So if you, uh, if you would please help us uh, uh, once again welcome the Cream Band and our last piece, Urban Light. You've all been such a wonderful audience. Thanks so much.